The peritoneum is the lining of the abdomen. I tell my patients it's kind of like the saran wrap that keeps all the organs in place. And on that surface, little tiny cells from cancer can spread and implant there. It's almost like when you blow a dandelion, the seeds can go and implant on parts of the lawn and start to grow. That's what can happen in the peritoneum. And that can be a, a pretty dramatic manifestation of cancer. It can form up to thousands of tumors that implant there and can cause bowel blockages and problems with nutrition for patients. It's a pretty devastating and, and frightening disease. But the good news is we do have treatments for this. Um, so peritoneal disease can come from a variety of places. It can come from the appendix and go to the peritoneum. It can come from the colon or the stomach. And how we treat your peritoneal surface malignancy is based on where it came from. Some respond better to chemotherapy, some to immunotherapy, and others respond well to the surgery I do, which is called cytoreductive surgery, and HIPEC, which is H-I-P-E-C, and that is heated intraperitoneal chemotherapy. So the concept of that procedure is to make a big incision, look around the abdomen, and any of those cancer implants that I can see, I remove. Once we do that part of the procedure, we then do heated chemotherapy. The combination of that surgery and the, the heated chemotherapy has good outcomes for patients. It can extend life, it can reduce symptoms of peritoneal disease. It's not perfect, it has its risks, but for those that we find and judge that are good candidates, the surgery can be really helpful.